Jeff, 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 how you doing tonight, Jeff? Okay. Susie, Elvin, Donna, Morgan, Katie. Another mic. All right. Well, okay, guys. Here we are. Let's get started here. Um, hopefully, I'm recording this so everyone can see it. And I want to welcome you. Um, obviously, you've already seen the video about what the product is we offer, so this won't be that long of a session today. So we'll just get started here. And I hope this is your final stop and the best sales opportunity today. And believe me, I should know. You're going to learn a little bit about me here in a moment. Um, <clears throat> one minute. Okay, so our agenda is I'm going to introduce myself. I'm going to talk about the state of sales out there in the real world of the United States. Um, we'll talk a little bit more about the opportunity and what action you can take if you're ready to get started. So let's get going. First of all, my name is Mike. I've been in sales for 25 years. I graduated from college in 1985 with a degree in um, business. And I quickly found out that uh, job opportunities were slim to none. We are in a recession at that time, if you recall. We're coming out of one. But we're, it seems like we're always in a recession. Somebody in the United States is in a recession at all times. It just depends on what's going on in your life, right? But anyway, you know, the, the offers out there were $15,000, $24,000 if you were lucky. And, of course, $24,000 was a lot, I guess, in 1985. But you have greater aspirations coming out of college. I guess that would equate to about forty-five dollars or fifty dollars today. It's less than that. Today you need a master's degree to get anywhere. But, you know, that was the best thing that happened in my life because I immediately went into sales. And I got a job selling um, life insurance for an outfit that we'd go into their homes, in-home sales, pitch them on a free benefit, and then upsell them on a package. And I was making about 50 grand a year, maybe 60 grand. And again, in 1985, that's like making 100 grand. And when you're 22 years old, making 100 grand is kind of foolish. Spent all my money, but learned a lot of valuable lessons. And... Uh, they changed the whole program, and I left that company. But anyway, I've been self-employed my entire life since then. I've went on to build three multi-million-dollar companies. I built a real estate company, a mortgage company before it was fashionable. In other words, this was back when you had to work to get loans done. It wasn't during the heyday when everyone was in the mortgage business. And finally, I built an insurance broker which was one of the number one brokers in the nation, and I was making well over a million dollars a year income personally. I don't say that to brag or anything. I'm telling you that to let you know I might know a little bit about building businesses and what great opportunities are. So I understand a few things today and a few things I've learned. Number one, this is exactly what I tell my kids. I have twin daughters that just started their first year in college. Um, not that I'm a big college fan, but you know I think it's a good way to learn how to think. But anyway, to ever be financially free, you must own your own business. Carry it in its store. If you ever want to be financially free, you must own your own business. Folks, if you're looking for a sales job, then essentially you are self-employed and own your own business. The problem is you're working under an umbrella and you're not getting all the benefits. The second thing I learned is you must be willing to work hard early on. Meaning, all three of those companies you see on the screen right now, I worked very hard for the first two, oh, two years, two and a half years. During the tail end of those businesses, I was hardly visible. I maybe worked 10 hours a, a week. And that I made more money because I learned early on that you must automate as much as possible and spend your time doing what you do best, and that's closing. And the reason you're watching this um, webinar or this video, whether you came in now live or later, is because I automate everything. Because I understand you're either going to be interested or you're not. And for those of you that are interested, we're going to touch base. For those of you that are not, I'm not going to waste my time with you. No offense, but there's no sense in me wasting five minutes on a phone call. That's why I'm running you through a process. So this is a funnel. X amount of people will respond to my ad. X amount of people will look at the um, opportunity and see if they, they see a potential in the product or service itself. X amount of people will get to the point you're at right now. And fewer people will want more information. Now, if you're, you know, if you're thinking, well, I, we'll just go on here. You'll see that this is one of the better opportunities available out there. Let's talk about that. Let's talk about the state of sales in the United States right now. First of all, let's, get, let's take the word sales out of the, the equation. Quit calling yourself a salesperson or a sales job because every single one of them, every single business owner is in the sales position almost every minute of our lives. Now, you may not see it that way, but think about it. When you meet new people, you try to sell yourself to them. When you apply for a job, you're selling yourself. When you raise your kids, try to instill your um, ethics, your morals, your, your life lessons, you're trying to sell them on your, your experience. When you're negotiating yourself, Okay? You're always selling, so get over the fear of selling. Selling is just talking to people, folks. 
when you're going in, when people think of salesperson, it's when you're going in to sell something that people don't need or want, and you convince them to see things your way. That's selling. If I'm going in uh, under the skies, I'm doing an energy audit or something, and I'm not really going in there to try to sell them solar water heaters, that's selling. I've got to convince them to see things my way and then try to get ticket money from them and make a commission. But when you're going to people and talking to them about something, a service product that they need or want, and that's very easy to understand and doesn't cost a lot of money, you're not selling. You're talking. Just like you're talking to people about a movie you saw. Okay? And today's opportunities stink. Now, if you came on here from Craigslist, you know what I'm talking about. I mean, what's available out there? Selling business to business, selling merchant services, which is credit card processing? Every third ad is that. I got news for you. Those small business owners get hit 10 times a day by someone trying to sell merchant services. Or they're selling insurance. And I made a great living selling insurance, but most people, along with real estate agents and mortgage brokers, go broke in that business. It's very difficult. Plus, you have to pay a lot of money to get licensed in all those things. Selling home improvements, I'm, early on in my life, when I was in my 20s, later 20s, I did home improvement sales, did very well. Um, again, that's selling, because you're going in there and they have no idea that they need it. You have to convince them that they need it. And, of course, telesales or telemarketing. And my favorite flavor of the day is selling Internet marketing services to small business owners. This is great. These guys that know how to build websites or do search engine optimization or Facebook or mobile marketing, which is all easy stuff, by the way. You know, they get you on there. They say, go out and sell these, business to, to these businesses because they don't want to do it themselves. And then they give you a commission, and you're building their long-term business. And when you leave because you burn out, they continue to get residual money from that business owner that you sold month in and month out. Is that what you really want, to build someone else's business? When you're doing all the work, these guys just don't want to spend the money on the marketing. That's you. And they don't even have to pay you. They don't even pay you unless you make a sale. Wouldn't that be nice if every business could just market themselves by getting people like you out on the street to go tell everyone about you? And if you happen to you know, bring me in some money, I'll give you some money. That's sales, guys. It's just junk, junk, junk. Now, here's the kicker. Most of these opportunities want you to generate your own leads so that you don't have to spend money, so they don't have to spend money marketing. And they let you build the future of their business with nothing in it for you, just like I mentioned. Guys, if you're out generating your own leads, and in this opportunity you will have to generate your own leads, in sales, why wouldn't you just own the business and find one of the thousands of people that can get you easily and actually do what, what it is you sell? Now see, with call, call MD, you don't have to do any of the back end. You don't have any customer service. You have a whole organization, six-year-old company taking care of you. You just got to go sell and make money month in and month out on something everybody needs or wants is affordable and you can sell to the master. If you're going to sell and generate your own leads, then build your business, not someone else's. The most important concept, residual income, get paid for your efforts over and over again. See, having a financial background, people put away with these stupid 401k plans, which I'll, that's another story. I won't get on my soapbox. It's a waste of money. They put away money for retirement. Why? Because they want to put together a nest egg that they can live off the interest. Folks, that's residual income. Interest is residual income. That's what we all strive to get to, is residual income. Well, why don't you start creating it now, regardless of your age, that you can create this month that pays you next month on top of what you earn next month. Residual income is the only way to go. That's why insurance was so powerful for me. I got residual income. And the second most important concept is, guys, you need to sell something. And excuse me for saying guys, ladies. I mean, I just always say guys. You need to sell something that people actually need or want or appeals to everybody and is easily affordable and can be sold to the masses. My brother once told me, sell to the masses, eat with the classes. Don't sell some fine luxury item that only 10 people in the world want. So now it's your turn. You're going to get to interview me by looking at the opportunity and see if it's right for you. Again, it's a multi-billion dollar opportunity called Call MD. Now, you've already seen the opportunity, so I'm going to go through these slides re relatively quickly just to kind of touch on a few of the um, services they provide. It's health care to wealth care. Okay? Uh, it's basically you're a medical connoisseur. Now, this is what the beautiful part about this is. When people ask me what I do, I tell them, I'm in the medical concierge business. Well, do you think that might get someone to ask me, well, what the heck is that? And I say, well, you know how you know these celebrities and uh, professional athletes, they're always on the road, they're going around. 
Uh, and they have medical issues just like you and I. Well, they don't have the opportunity to go to their doctor, so all they do, they have to call somebody. And then they get prescription things wherever they're at. Well, now we're bringing that to the American public, to everybody in the street. It's medical concierge. And it's, they, you know, Colin B. called it the telemedicine business. I just call it med medical concierge. It sounds more appealing. You say that to somebody, you're going to get their attention. What is that? Now, you already saw the current health care situation. It's sickening. Half of us don't have health insurance. The other half are paying way too much for it. No, Obamacare is not going to work. Nothing's going to work. This, this prices just keep going up and up. Now, you've got to keep in mind, Call MD is not an insurance program. It's an assurance program. Okay, it gives you peace of mind. If you look at the average cost of the ER visit in 2010 was $1,465. When 70%, let's see if I can get a highlight over here. 70% of room visits were not emergency, but they were still paying that money. And if you had a stomach problem, it was up to 4000 Look, here's a story. The average cost of visits to a walk-in clinic was $110 in 2010. This is a true story. I'll tell you two quick stories. I was out of uh, Colorado, and I, um, I was actually out of the country living for a while, and I came back to Colorado. And I, I have had gout my entire adult life. I get it periodically. It comes on. And I was with my parents, and I got gout. And I don't have a doctor here, so they called their doctor and said, well, I talked to him. I said, I have gout. I need some medicine. Well, you have to come in to get a prescription. Okay, I'll come in. So it cost me $120 to visit the doctor, and they made me, and I had to wait four days, and gout's very painful, four days of agony. And it got, I had to wait two hours in the waiting room. I spent $120 for the doctor visit, and they insisted that they drew blood from me so they can get another $300-something out of me. Just to get a prescription for something I've always had and always and I know what I need. But with Call MD, I could have just called up. They would have seen my record on file. They would have called in the prescription. I would have walked down and got my medicine in within two hours. Now, the second story concerns one of my daughters came down from college. She had a sinus infection, which she get quite often. Okay, her mother called up Call MD. They prescribed the medicine for her. In two hours, she had her medicine. Now, the other thing you get with Call MD is not just the uh, medicine concierge. You also get this huge discount on prescription drugs. Okay, the medicine, the um, antibiotic that my daughter normally gets is normally $35. Well, they picked it up for $4. So that alone paid for the cost of Call MD for that month, just the savings on the prescription drugs. And the average family spends over $180 a month on prescription medicines. So there's big savings there. So there's, you know, three plans, and we're only going to, you know, we've only touched on two. Uh, well, we're going to touch on two, which is the $19.95 plan, which is the Call MD where you can just call 24-7, 365, talk to a nurse, lay out your plan, uh, what's going on, they'll have your records in front of you, and then they can just prescribe something. If they feel like you need a doctor, you'll have a doctor call you for a consultation. That'll cost an additional $35, but then they'll call in the prescription. Okay? Again, this includes the prescription discount card. But this $19.95 covers the entire household, everyone in your family that lives under that same roof. It's not $19.95 per person, it's everyone in the family. Then you have the 49.90 plan per month, which is the way most people choose to come in, which also you get everything in the basic plan, but you also get the Optum Health Allies. Okay, again, this is not an insurance plan, but this gives you great discounts on all kinds of medical procedures that have been prearranged. So if the doctor feels like you need an MRI or something like that, you can go to this um, this group with over 600,000 professionals in it and get a huge pre. Uh, pre-arranged discount on any services you need. Now, on top of your insurance, okay? So that's primary care, alternative care, dental, vision, and much more. You also get addiction programs, smoking cessation programs, weight loss programs, massage therapy, in-home nurses, hearing aids, behavioral health programs, and much more. So this is the program most people choose to come in at. The third program is the VIP program, which I'm not going to go over here. VIP is basically everything. On top of that, it's a $99 a month plan, which is my favorite, to be honest with you because it also includes uh, identity, theft pre identity theft protection and prepaid legal. If any of you guys have ever heard of prepaid legal, that's included in the, you get all this plus prepaid legal in a $99 plan. And there's no cost, there's no $35 charge for a doctor consultation if uh, the doctor needs to talk to you. The $99 plan is well worth attending. Again, it covers the whole house, not just the individual. So I, I know by now you say, well, how are you going to make any money selling a $19 product or a $50 product or a $99 product? And we'll get to that in just a moment. Okay. But first you can see 
I, I ask you, can you see how everybody needs or wants this product? And it's easy to communicate it to people. It's very simple. There's no selling involved. You just present it. I'm in the I'm a medical I'm in the medical concierge business. What's that? Here it is. That's awesome. Yeah, save you a lot of money. Want to sign up? <laughs> there it is. It's a program you wouldn't mind bringing your family, friends, and neighbors. So how does it work? It's real simple. You need help, you get help. You call a toll-free doctor number, you speak to the registered needs, nurse, and, fill, and the documentation is filled out, and boom. She'll make a decision, and you go from there. You get advice, you get diagnosed, you get your prescriptions, you get better, and the nurse gives you a follow-up call. Now, remember, I did say that if the nurse feels you need to talk to a doctor, which doesn't happen all the time, because most of your, for my gout instance, for example, it's already there. They know it's gout, and I'm asking for gout medicine. There's no need for me to talk to a doctor. If you have the VIP plan, that $35 doesn't exist. Um, it's easy to get set up. Once you become a member, you log on to the website. You fill out your registration form, which is basically health questions, just like you do when you go to a, a doctor for the first time. And after that, you're just using the phone. If you don't, if you don't feel like going to the website and doing this, call in Plus will reach out to you and sign you up. Remember we talked about the deep discounted prescription cards uh, and the stability of the networks. We have over 800 board-certified doctors and registered nurses in all 50 states and Puerto Rico, a nationwide network of over half a million health care providers. And here's the place, some of the places you get your prescriptions filled out, which is just about every place that you're getting them done right now. This is one of the most powerful parts of this. Second, this one, and the one I'm gonna, I don't have a slide on, but I want to talk to you about. This is the benefits for employers. Okay? This is where you can make very good money. You go to small business, medium-sized business, even a large business, and you present this opportunity. Now, most employers, companies, are backing off on their benefits. They can't afford them anymore. They're getting too expensive. And you can approach these employers, these companies, and say, why don't you offer this to your employees? Choose a plan. There's a great benefits to you. Number one, you're offering benefits, so it's going to be easier to um, pull in better people. Number two, you're going to reduce the employee's sick days. No longer do your employees got to call it leave work for a half a day to go to a doctor to get something that can be done over the phone. It's like having an in-house medical service. Okay, there's no change in monthly fees. It's a great upgrade to their existing benefit. Or they can actually increase their deductible on their group health insurance, saving them money, and then offer this. And of course the employee benefits by everything we've talked about. So it's a win-win situation. So imagine this. Now you go into a small business that has 10 employees. You can get you show the program to the owner. He offers it to the 10 employees. They go into a $49 plan. Now you just made a $500 sale. And you'll see how you get paid in a moment. One of our reps went to a local university. A university, I don't know what university or what plan they got on. on they won't tell us. But he signed up 8,000 people. So just doing the math, if they chose the $20 a month plan, this rep, is going to make about $50,000 a month or more in residual income every single month from here on out, from one sale. Now, that's an aberration. That's not going to happen to most of you out there. This guy probably had an in with the school already or was already a uh, professor there or something. But that leads me to my second favorite part of this program, which is our 501c program or nonprofits. Now, most of you belong to some kind of group that's a nonprofit organization such as a church or something. Watch how this benefits the church. And this is where I would start if I was you. I'd go to your pastor or your rabbi or whomever you're with and say, can I present this program to the parishioners? And here's how you benefit, Mr. Church. For everyone that signs up, you're going to get 25% of the monthly due from each parishioner. Every single month, as long as they remain a member. And by the way, we only have a, we have, we have a, we have a 90% retention rate which means most people that sign up stay with the program because they are getting valuable benefits. That's very powerful. So you go to your church, you present this, and everybody wins. And you'll see how you get paid on that in a moment, too. So now the church has this by offering their person or something they should have anyway, they're getting monthly income. So here's how we'll talk about the compensation plan. First, I want to let you guys know that before you freak out, this is a network marketing company or direct sales organization. But before you freak out because you've heard all the negative things about that, hold on for a moment with me. Because every company's network marketing. Everyone. 
the government's network marketing. So just bear with me and let's get through this. So as I talk about this, you're going to see what I mean. So basically, let's just talk if you, to you because you're looking for a sales opportunity. If you just went out and presented this plan to people, you could probably, you could, well, let's get into conversation. Basically, if you just wanted to be a retail seller and you don't want to build a team of anyone, you make 50% of the initial order. So in our example where the guy, um, let's say you went into the business, sold 10 people at $500, you're going to make $250 right then. You're paid weekly. But better than that, guys, is this. Every month thereafter, you're going to make 30, up to 33% of that $500. So that's over $150 a month off the sale you made last month. So you get now money, and you get future residual money. That's powerful. So if you work just the exact same amount every single month, your income will increase. Now, if you want to get into building a team, now what I mean by that is, look, if you're in any sales organization, the top sales guys in any company are promoted to district managers or regional managers or whatever because that gives them the opportunity to make overrides off of salespeople they bring in and train and recruit. That's all network marketing is, except it lets it go deep. But network marketing, you're the CEO of your own company. You can have, so if you want to recruit other salespeople, basically kind of like what I'm doing right now, you can go that deep and you make 3% all the way down. Now I'm not going to get into these numbers because they're not important. Let me tell you why. Anytime anyone asks me about this stuff, I know they're going to fail. All that matters, folks, is that you go out, you talk to people, tell them you're in the medical concierge business, and you sign people up. Once you sign them up, then you mention, you know, if you got friends and relatives that might want to want this opportunity, you know, you can make some money doing it. Some people won't want to do that. Some people will. That's it. And you just build a team that way. Then you get them onto our webinars, the corporate webinars and all that thing, and let everyone else help them build their business. They may not even want to build a business. They just want, might want to make money signing up three or four people. That's fine. Let them. The bottom line is this. To be successful with any company, you need to make sales. Don't rely on everyone else making sales for you. Some will, some won't. So what next? And some of the people that you enroll as a, a, a retail customer will want to learn about the business opportunity. It's that simple. People complicate things. Just talk to people about the program. So you can see how easily you can go out on any lunch hour, sell two of these, and your hour break and make 50 bucks. That's it. But the next month you're going to make money off of that $100 that you sold at that lunch break. So some of you might want to do this part-time, some of you might want to do it full-time. It doesn't matter. If you believe in the product and the service, and I believe you do, otherwise you wouldn't be this far, then it's easy to talk to people about it. If you don't believe in it, you wouldn't be this far into the presentation. So the cost of becoming an associate, you know, you, when you hear about these network companies, you know, oh, well, to become an associate, i got to pay two, three, five, hundred dollars, a thousand dollars. Well, no, not here. To become an associate, you pay a one-time annual fee of $30 to get your websites and your um, tools and your back office. It's $30 for the whole year. And then you simply pick the package you want to be on. Again, most people pick this one. It's up to you. You can come in at the $19.95. So you can, get a, you can start your own business today for as little as $49.95. You can always upgrade later. Now, that's an opportunity. Where can you start a business for $49.95 and then just go out and talk? You're looking for a sales position anyway. Why don't you sell something that makes you real money? Now, down the road, you can become an ambassador. This is when you upgrade to become a, a, a business builder like myself. Uh, I don't make any commission off this if you upgrade to $199. Okay? But now you're in $100 or more per referral with our customer acquisition bonus. So it gets pretty powerful. That's not something you need to consider at this point. If you want to learn more about that, I can talk to you when you call. But that's not where you're at right now. But it's available to you. Again, the commission, when you enroll someone as an associate or a retail customer, you will receive 50% of the total collected. 
And starting on month two, you'll receive 10 to 33% every month that your associate or customer continues with your service. And I told you we have a 90% retention rate. And if you come on as an associate or you up, up, come in to actually be a, a, just, um, a team builder, there's 10 more ways to earn income, which I'm not going to go into here. Suffice it to say, folks, get people enrolled, you're going to make money. It's that simple. Oh, one more thing on this. When I was talking about the church example, the nonprofit example, the church gets 25% every month, and you make 10% every month. But think of the audience you have. So just make sure you understand that that's a little bit different commission structure. But look, guys, you can go out this week, talk to your pastor or your rabbi or whomever, and get this thing going now and make money this week. Or any other nonprofit you work with, or any business you work with. Uh, the process of duplication, this is just showing you how the more people you sign up to um, be a distributor or work under you or you know become a team player, how it can really add up. I'm not going to go into it, but obviously the power of duplication is powerful. All of a sudden, one day, you're just making money out of the blue that you had no idea was coming. Because some of the people you sign up, with the state of the economy right now, you can't believe how many responses I get on my ad. Over 60 on one ad in one day. That's how bad it is out there. So a lot of people you talk to are going to want to learn a way to make a little extra money every month and will become an associate. It just naturally happens. All right, so why call MD Plus? Well, with the current U.S. health care situation, there's no better time to join our team. The company's six years old, but this division of it, the networking division, is only two months old, and you're in the pre-launch. Now's the time to do it. Uh, you're providing a service that you can be proud to present. You're not, well, I got this, mo this cool juju juice that makes you healthy with no proof. It's not tangible. It's a juice. Or I got this travel site. Oh, yeah, but in case you travel. Everybody needs a doctor. You know, a lot of people did very well with prepaid legal. How often do you really need a lawyer? You'll need a lawyer sometime in your life, but how often? But we all, every single person you talk to, needs a doctor. And more than once a year. And if they had a service like this, they wouldn't put off some of the things they put off. They just make the call, get the medicine, get healthy. You're helping people. So if you're providing service people you, you should be proud of. The commission plan works. No matter your goal, extra income, a new career, financial security for your family, it's all achievable with Call and Um As an associate, you all get a website, your own website. It's easy to use, leadership, videos, testimonials, and program choices. People can enroll very easy, and below this video, you'll see my link to my private site, which has online tools, prescription finder, find a doctor, live help, and more. So, folks, that's the opportunity in a nutshell. It's not that complicated. If you want me to sit here and talk for two hours, I could, but why? You get it. You have a product that appeals to almost everybody, that everybody needs, because we all need a doctor, that's affordable. I mean, if you can't afford $20 for your whole family, then you got your... Uh, Priority screwed up because I get I guarantee you got cable or dish. Twenty dollars a month. Most people come in at the uh, forty, the fifty dollar a month program, or the ninety nine dollar program. So it's affordable to everybody, and it appeals to the masses. Everybody you talk to. I'm a medical concierge. So a word about direct referral marketing, guys. As I said, every company is a network marketing company. I've already went through this. You have your sales organization. Every company has to be in sales. Every company. I don't care if you're a dentist grocery store, local retailer, restaurant. This is one thing small business owners don't ever understand. We're all, all business owners are in the exact same business. We're all in sales and marketing. Because we could have the best product or service in the world, but if it falls on deaf ears, who cares? So you always have to market your business. So people hire, they spend money on advertising, they spend money on uh, salespeople to bring in new business. This is how we choose to spend our money on advertising. We want to pay you. That's the bottom line. Why go out and advertise in newspapers, television, and all that when we can redirect all that money to you folks? Because you don't have a problem telling people about a great movie or a restaurant you ate at. Why would you have a problem telling someone about a great service you get? You know, I had gout the other day. All I did was call MD+. What's MD+. Oh, no, it's a concierge service. What's that? Oh, let me tell you. Give me five minutes, I'll tell you. Give me three minutes, I'll tell you. So again, don't complicate this. Well, I hope I've piqued your interest. I know some of you are not interested. I hope most of you are. If, you really, if you're really sincere about becoming financial free and if you're really sincere about sales, 
If you're going to go pound on business to business anyway, why don't you sell them something that they'll actually buy and something that will give you residual income. But if you have more questions, I'm here to answer them. Just call me direct at 720-203-5649. Or, as I said, there's my private website. You can learn more or sign up at daily.callingdplus.net. And remember, I'm here to help you succeed. I've built three multi-million dollar businesses. I know a little bit about how things work. It's not complicated. Okay? I mean, I just built a system to get you here. I can put, put a system like this for you together in a, in a heartbeat. It's not complicated. Um, tomorrow I'm going to call, call, call on churches. I'm just going to walk in and say, hey, i got a great opportunity for you to get monthly income for your, for your church. Oh, really? What? what let me, you got five minutes? Sure. That's simple. Or any small business. Now, if you're calling on small businesses, I'd give you a different advice. I wouldn't go in there looking for the owner because they're not going to be there or they have their gatekeepers trying to keep you out. That's beautiful because you can talk to anybody. And, when, and once you sign someone up on this plan, you find out where they work and say, well, don't, do you think your boss might want to see this or your, the other employee? Yeah, why don't you get me in to have a little group presentation? Wow, what an easy way to get in there because now that person's going to look like a hero anyway. Now, there's just so many ways to do this, folks, and I'm here to help you succeed. So I'm going to end this. I'm not going to do a question and answer session here on the webinar, but, you know, again, you can call me at 720-203-5649. Ask questions. I may not have all the answers, but I'll get you the answer, and we'll go from there. Now, remember, guys and gals, massive changes start with quick and massive action. You know, sitting around contemplating whether you want to do this or not is not going to make you any money tomorrow. Okay. You can keep going to Craigslist looking for some um, some great miraculous job that's going to be perfect. Some of those companies provide you leads. I can tell you telemarketing leads and things of that nature are really icky. Most, most of the opportunities out there, they're telling you to go generate your own leads anyway, so why wouldn't you generate leads that you can earn residual income at month after month after month? You may be thinking, well, the ticket item is not big enough. I just showed you if you can sell 10 to 1 business, how you make $250 in pay. I just showed you how you can get into those businesses. I showed you where to start with your local group, nonprofit group. Don't complicate. All right, folks, I want to thank you for taking your time. And um, give me a call, and we'll, I hope you join us. Have a great day or evening.